uh, tall goldenrod plants. Um, as you can see, some of them have swelling around the stem, which is called the gall. Inside of the gall, see if you see here. Inside of the gall is um, is a maggot, which is the larva of a fly called the goldenrod fly. Um, you can see there's a double one over here. Um, and then this one's kind of white, probably from last year. Um, the fly's entire life revolves around the goldenrod plant, from birth to life to death. Um, and in order to lay her eggs, the female has an ovipositor tube that comes from her abdomen and pierces the stem when it's green and during the summertime, so it's easier to pierce. Um, and then they're not very good flyers. They only live for about two weeks, but the life of the, the maggot inside the gall um, is from when she deposits the eggs during the summer to the next spring. And during that time, um, the larva eats its way around the inside of the gall, and during the winter, it produces a chemical similar to antifreeze that keeps it from dying in the winter. And in the spring, it basically eats its way out. Woodpecker, chickadees, there's a couple beetles and wasps that also prey on it. Um, okay, so let's see. hard to cut. Probably would be easier if it was still green, like in summer. The other side. As you can see, it's hard to open, which is what protects the maggot larva inside from except for the few that are listed. I don't want to break your blade. Mm, okay, this side I don't see one, but this is the inside. If you can kind of see in here, there is the maggot right here. And that's what lives inside the gall. Um, I don't see any tunnels yet, so I guess it hasn't started eating away at the inside to prepare for spring next year, but yeah. There you go. <laughs>